trying to like warm up my my brain right now. I understand. So, it's early in the morning. Natural. Let, break, like, break down break down the word. What is what what does the word super mean and what does the word natural mean, right? And well, yeah, it'd be like an awesome, awesome supreme being, right? Well, not yes, an all supreme being is an example of a supernatural thing, but what does supernatural mean? Uh, I don't I don't fucking remember this. Well, um, okay, so I understand that it's early in the morning, but let's do do you know do you know how to break down words using the roots and the, the definitions? Like, what does natural mean for you, Zeke? It's natural. It's all natural. Nice. So natural means natural. Can we can we do something without using the word to define the word? Uh, no, nothing. Like it, it was, it was already. Oh, uh, I don't know, dude. It's top of the morning. Okay. Well, so you were very active in the chat, telling me that I intellectually don't understand something. You were, you, you were cognizant enough, like cognizant enough to be able to make that statement. And I'm, and I'm asking you to clarify a few things here. And it doesn't seem like you're intellectually capable to be able to clarify these very simple you're terms. You're making me clarify like if this is a fucking class of language. Um, what do we use to communicate, Zeke? We use words and sounds. Okay, w word, words are language, correct, Zeke? Sure. So if I'm asking for you to clarify your words so that I could better understand what you mean, <laughs> based on what you said in the chat that I intellectually don't understand you, I'm asking for you to how 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 can you express your intellect to me, Zeke? How what? How how can you express your intellect to me? Oh, well, just observing, dude. <laughs> Observing is a way to express your intellect to me. Yeah, I'm observing. Okay. It's quite common sense. So when I ask you to, to explain to me what you're observing, you're having a hard time doing that, Zeke. There's, I'm not having a hard time. <laughs> I, I asked you to explain to me, I asked you to explain to me what supernatural means, because that is your observation, that there are supernatural forces at play. Yes. Yeah, so, so, so if you, if you, if you believe that there are supernatural forces at play, how would you know what a supernatural force is if you're having a difficult time explaining to me what supernatural means? Um... It'd be more of like an observation. Okay. Can, okay. So, if for you to be able to observe something, Zeke, you would have to know what it is, right? You would you would have to be able to describe what it is that you're seeing, right? In incorrect. So, in order to observe something, you don't have to describe it. Uh, correct. Okay. So. You observe things, and I just have to take your word that you observe the thing, and you don't even have to tell me what it is. You just say, I saw a thing, and it was supernatural. Yeah, we just make claims like science. Like, boom. Oh, my friend, sci that. science doesn't make claims. Science uh, gathers information using instrumentation to be able to come to a conclusion based on said observational data. It's still wrong. Okay. I'm I'm sorry that the public education system has failed you as much as it has, Zeke. It seems like you have a difficult time expressing simple ideas. So this conversation is meant to be had with people that are more capable than you. Is it, I'm gonna go ahead and just drop you now, unless you can define supernatural for me. You know, man, you already know the truth. <laughs> it's just, it's your life. Okay. Where Mothwoman said, 
Zeke, you had zero answers. And he said, yeah, I don't answer easy philosophical questions. And then Moth Woman said, I think you couldn't. And Zeke responded with, I am rubber and you are glue and anything you say goes right back to you. I think you couldn't either. So Zeke literally has the emotional intelligence of a grade schooler based on the interaction that I had with him. That's not an insult, that's an observation. And you see how I'm, I'm expressing that observation in a way that can be easily communicated to the people that are listening? So that's how... That's what do how, you need to learn, boss? What do you want to know? Um, what does supernatural mean, Zeke? Are you serious? Are you still yes. asking me the easy question? Yes. Can you please answer this easy question for me, please? Uh, we are... We are what 10 does, steps ahead, boss. What does the term supernatural mean, Zeke? I think we both know what it means, and we can move on. <laughs> no, Zeke, see, that's the thing. I don't actually know that you know because you have yet to communicate with me any understanding <laughs> of the term. So until I understand that you are on the same page as me, we're not going to turn pages. We're not going to go 10 pages ahead. We're, we haven't passed the first page because you refuse to answer any there questions. Is. So, all right. the question here is, what, what, does do supernatural, know, what does supernatural mean, Zeke? Please and thank you. That's what I want to know. This, dude, are you serious? Is that all you want to know today? No, that's not all I want to know, Zeke. I want to know more, but I need to, I need to get a, did you not hear any words that came out of my mouth earlier, Zeke, that I want to have a base level of understanding with you so that we can build on that base of understanding? And in order for me to build on that base of understanding, there needs to be trust between what you say and what you know. And just because you say, trust me, bro, I know, I don't trust you. I need you to exemplify that you actually do know by answering the question, what does supernatural mean for you, Zeke? So for me, it'd mean um, something that is very powerful. Okay. And it's super natural, which means it has extincts, which are all extincts. What's an extinct? Uh, some form of. It's a form of biological, oh, what's the word, dude? I'm losing the white words right now. So that's, that's what I'm trying to. That's, oh, it's a type of like, it, you know what extinct is, dude? No, I don't. Did you mean instinct? Same shit. No, because extinct means it's no longer in existence. Well, I meant instinct. Okay, you see how words matter, Zeke? Dude, you, like, they matter, but I'm literally just saying them right now. I I'm aware that you're not thinking much before you say the words that are coming out like, of your you mouth. You know what word I'm saying. There's just it's compatible words. So words have words mean things, Zeke. And in order for us to communicate with each other to to any sort of understanding, we have to use words that we agree on their meaning. So we agree on your understanding, and then you can agree on my understanding. As of right now, I don't think you actually understand what I'm saying, and I don't. And I for sure shit don't understand half of what's coming out of your mouth. Uh, you know you are just wrong dude <laughs> what have i what have i said that's wrong zeke can you tell me what i have said that is wrong please premise one you said i don't understand a word that you're saying bro for me like what do you believe that our morality comes from a supernatural point of provenance um Um, sure. I'm not sure. Sure. Okay. Um, what does supernatural point of providence mean, Zeke? Supernatural providence, dude? No. Point of providence. Not providence. Uh, this is provenance. 
what is what does providence mean, Zeke? That's that's a word I haven't heard. Ah, lately. so so you don't understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? Is that what you're admitting? No, provenance. Got it. Got it. Okay, Pretty cool. Proof. That you do not understand the concepts that I would like to have a conversation about. Well, you psychologically and scientifically are wrong. You don't know what you're going to say. Um, you're not proving a point. I'm not, I'm not, Zeke. I'm trying to have a conversation. There's no points in trying to have conversations other than reaching a mutual understanding of concepts. We don't need that. We don't need that. <laughs> we, we don't need You have need your foundation. That. I have mine founded, and we are good at debating we can debate this isn't this isn't a debate zeke bro there's not going to be a winner or a loser on this and if you leave this conversation assuming that one of us won and one of us lost it's the equivalent of cheating on a self-graded test bro <laughs> bro <laughs> so um what are you trying to prove though that God doesn't exist? I'm, I'm asking people to, to define what God means for them. And in order to understand what God means for them, I would like to understand that they understand concepts like supernatural, which you have yet to prove to me that you understand. What you described to me could very well be electricity, magnetic waves could very what? well, like, yes, when you said it's something pow powerful, something powerful and has a biological component that is built into its instincts. Yeah, I don't think that applies to what uh, I just said. Okay, can you define supernatural for me, Zeke, please? Because I have a misunderstanding of what you believe supernatural is. Um, I'll, I'll scientifically try to... Oh, yeah. No, no, no. I don't, I, don't, I don't need your scientific understanding. I need just you. You. Zeke, what does supernatural mean? I already told you. A type of supreme power of being, uh, the laws of nature. Supreme power or being. Okay, so you're using the word super to define super and then natural to define natural yet again. I need you to, I need you to define. Let's break it down then. What does super mean, Zeke? To an extent, to like a super, I don't fucking know, dude. This is like grade A pieces of shit. Yes, and you are failing. Yeah, because I have, I'm on top of more knowledge. I'm not going back 50 steps back. Like, what are you trying to do? So you're telling me that you, you, you built this knowledge on faulty ground. What happens when you build your castles in sand, Zeke? I didn't build my castle on <laughs> sand. Yeah, Zeke, you don't understand the. You don't even understand, understand the term. The, you, don't understand, you, don't don't you don't even understand. You don't even understand. You don't even understand. You don't. You, you don't cope. Know, know you, what cope you, mean, you cope. You cope with words, but you don't. You cope with words, but you don't need to understand what they mean. I don't have to define. The, 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 I don't have to define what they mean. I said, I understand. You know, I understand if I can cope. <laughs> Yes, God does exist, boss. Okay, cool. So what does God mean for you, Zeke? Um, God, um, our creator in the spiritual realm, spiritual form. Okay, so uh, what does spiritual mean for you, Zeke? Um... Uh, like coinciding with um, phrenology, uh, astrology. Um. Did you say phrenology? Uh, yeah. The study of the human skull and the shape of that skull, it, it, how it affects the characteristics of a being? Yeah, so. Oh, that. I I wasn't aware. Study, I wasn't study. aware that you. I wasn't aware that you were an idiot, Zeke. I am so sorry. Um, I, that, because I too can just throw out random words and attempt to sound intelligent, but that's, I mean, phrenology was used historically to justify slavery. Like, 